three months ago, I reviewed this Boblov N9 body camera and viewers commented, hey, you forgot to do the night vision capabilities and if it's waterproof um, and shock resistant. So stick around and I'll share those details with you. Hey there, and welcome back to the channel. If you're new, please consider subscribing, and then you'll know when I come out with new content. My name is Russ, and I'll give you tips on how to improve your earnings and ratings for food delivery companies. Three months ago, I did a review on the Boblov N9 body camera, and a few of the viewers commented, wow, it would have been nice if you would have included the night vision capabilities, as well as show if it's waterproof or shockproof. So today, I'm gonna do that. So let's slide over into the next seat where we can have some room and I'll show you a close up of the camera. And then later once it gets dark tonight, I'll go out and shoot some footage and include it so you can see if the night vision is good enough for your needs. And the reason I didn't include it before, I primarily don't deliver at night, so it didn't even enter my mind. So thank you so much to the viewers who commented on that. And you can see them popped up right here. So thank you, I really appreciate it. Let's take a look at, and I'll use this flashlight so you can see, is the camera waterproof? The answer is no, but it is water resistant. You can see if the rain comes down here on the side, but if you notice, you can uh, pry up this cap. This one came off, but you can see it still fits in by pressure. If this little rubber cap is missing, water could get in there and damage the camera. And you can see it just fits in there by pressure. And that's enough to protect it when you're using it, but you should not submerge it. So you can see the micro SD card uh, cover is on the bottom and it just kind of pries up and you just move it to the side. Obviously it helps to have two hands doing this. Anyway, you can see below there where the micro SD card is. So does this mean it's waterproof? No, but if it is raining or light mist, you know, it's fine to be using, but do not submerge it. So I hope that answers the question about is it waterproof? The next one, is it shockproof? I would say yes, I've accidentally dropped this, as I mentioned the other video, a few times, and it did keep working, so that's a good thing. But just like with any electronic item, I would not throw it around or toss it around. And then you may notice that the mount that I use is the shoulder mount. And the reason I do that is because I will take this part and slide it into my pants. And then up here, this will angle so that you can get a good view of me delivering food. Over time, this does wiggle and it gets loose. So what I'll do is I'll use Loctite and I'll put a few drops in here and it'll keep that mount strong. Right now I do see that this is a little wiggly and that's probably because of this connection here. So maybe I'll put some Loctite in there and see what happens. So you can see there is some uh, play and movement in here. But for what I use it for, it's definitely good enough. I'd like to thank Fadley, Sajon, and Christetta for your comments. Thank you so much for encouraging me to make this follow-up video and I hope that you did find the close-ups helpful. And then I look forward to later tonight, including the night vision footage, and hopefully that'll help you make a good decision if this camera is right for you. So right now it's morning, and let's just go ahead and wait until it gets dark. We'll be patient. <laughs> okay, just kidding. We'll come back when it's dark. Sorry, I'm just dropping off some food. Hi everyone, I am using the Boblov N9 camera now and I can see the red infrared lights are glowing. And so obviously this is night vision. 
The time is 6.30 p.m. in Southern California. The sun is setting, but it's not completely dark by any means. I would say in another 30 minutes it'll be dark. So I'm going to come back and I'll show you footage when it's completely dark. But hopefully this gives you an idea. Even now at dusk, uh, the sensors do kick on. Hi everyone, it's almost 9 o'clock at night, and this is my car. So we'll just walk up and uh, see how the night vision looks on this. Setting a nice can there. I'm about 8 feet away right now. Alrighty everyone, it is definitely dark. 18, 16, 14, 12, 10, 8, 6 feet away from you right now. So I hope that you can appreciate the capabilities of the Boblov N9 camera using the night vision. And earlier you saw uh, the delivery that I did at dusk. It was about 6.30 p.m. And then right now it's 9 and the... Uh, can on the car you can see the visibility there and then of course right now I can't see myself so I'll just have to trust that it is adequate so I hope this information is helpful to you and if you decide to buy the camera I personally recommend it I think it's a good um, camera for under a hundred dollars you know the Osmo GoPros are nice but they don't have night vision and they cost far more so for this camera it's a great deal and I do recommend it Please share in the comments below, have you considered buying this camera, and are you going to? Alright, until I see you on my next video, take care. Bye!